Hi Makeup Junkies, uh, welcome to, back to my channel. Um, today I'm going to do one of my all time favourite things which is a haul, um, so sit back and relax because it's going to be a long one. Um, I went to Superdrug Boots Primark and Superdrug Boots Primark and Kex or CEX, whatever you want to call it, um, and HMV. Um, I'm going to get the non-beauty bits out of the way first because that's just how I roll. Um, right, so went into HMV because I wanted to get a um, duplicate copy of my blue CD, which is all rice, couldn't find it, um, but my daughter found one um, and it's all time blue hips or something, which she got, um, but she's got that in the bedroom. But the ones I picked up, I picked up the Wanted CD, which I've always wanted. Ha ha ha, pardon the pun. That's in the car. The other one I picked up is an all-time favourite, and oh my God, this is such a blast from the past. Share! Sure. I love this. This has got so many good songs on it. Um, if I could turn back time. Uh, many Rivers to Cross. Um, just like Jesse James, I love that song. It's one of my favourites. Um, Dead Ringer, Bang Bang, um, Shoot Shoot song from Mermaids, absolutely brilliant. So I picked that one up, that was 5 99 Then I also picked up the very best Fleetwood Mac, which I absolutely adore Fleetwood Mac. Um, there's so many different songs on here. If you can see some of the songs that are on here. Absolutely gorgeous, I love it. So I'm gonna be listening to that in the car soon. Um, then I picked up now, don't judge me, guys. You may think I'm sad. I don't care. But I've wanted this for so long. One day, this is us. I absolutely love One Direction. And I'm not ashamed to say it. Um, at the age of 42, I think they're fantastic. They're brilliant singers. Brilliant, all-round entertaining guys. Um, they're, they're lovely. And I wanted this. So I got that from HMV. That was £6.99. Um, then I went into Kex and got the uh, two series of vampire diaries that i hadn't got so i picked up series three which is this one um this one series three was i think that was 10 pounds which isn't bad considering it's the whole series three of the um vampire diaries which i love and also picked up season four which was 15 pounds um but yeah oh don't you just wish? Oh, I love this guy. I love this man. Um, so I picked up that one. Then I went into Primark just to get some bits because my daughter was doing her birthday shopping. And I picked up a couple of my favourite, um, new favourite, should I say, uh, facial wipes. And these are the cucumber ones. Um, they're exfoliating. They've got little tiny beads on them. As you can see, the beads on the packet, the, the actual wipe looks like that. These are brilliant. 25 wipes for a pound. Um, so I've got two of those. Got another one there. Then I also picked up some socks. Now, I don't know about you guys, but these are just so fitting for a YouTube beauty viewer. I just think they're brilliant. Right, these ones got lipsticks on them. Then, plain dots. Then we've got, what does this say? I don't know what it This one says Gloss and Glamour lipstick. Uh, the next one's just stripey, and then we've got Gloss and Glamour in the green colour as well. And they were just £2.50. I think these are gorgeous. I love trainer socks. Very nice. Right, then I went into Superdrug. Um, guys, you know what I'm like in Superdrug? I'm awful. Um, I went in there just to look around, really. Um, this, what I've got from Superdrug, I'm about to show you now, is two trips. So... Again, don't judge me. Right, everyone knows that I love my Katy Perry. Um, absolutely adore it. Uh, the Killer Queen one comes in a beautiful little triangle bottle. She's now brought out Killer Queen Oh So Sheer. Um, yeah, it's looking blue on the camera. I don't know why. It is actually a purple packaging, sort of a light lilac -y purple packaging. This is the 100ml bottle, and it was 20 quid. It was half price. Half price at the moment in Superdrug. It comes like this. It's got a gorgeous lilac y sort of coloured thing. Um, absolutely gorgeous. So, yeah, love that. <clears throat> so, I picked that one up. That was £20. And it smells gorgeous. It smells exactly the same as the Killer Queen. It's just a lot lighter, I suppose. 
Killer Queen's quite sweet, quite tense, intense. Um, this one is still sweet, but it's not as in your face intense. Then in Superdrug, I think I got this in Superdrug. I think they're on special offer. I've got a Carex wash in um, Mandarin and Bergamot. Absolutely smells gorgeous. Divine. Then speaking of Divine, um, I picked up the I Divine Garden of Eden palette which you have all seen, um, swatches of, so many people have done it. I've got the snakeskin wrapper, That's, it's all right, I don't think I'll keep the box, but yeah, I've got this, gorgeous colors. I have worn this a couple of times, I wore a green smoky eye, which I absolutely love. Um, speaking of 1D again, um, I picked up the MUA 1D Up All Night palette, which is just gorgeous. Colors in here are amazing, and they're so pigmented. Um, Let's just swatch a couple for you now. Let's go for that deeper purple. Right, that's the colours. That's just a couple of the colours. Um, yeah, absolutely gorgeous. Some are shimmery, some are not. And they're just amazing, so I love that. Then I picked up a couple of Impulse sprays. Uh, did I get these in? I might have got these in Wilco's, actually. Actually, I got these in Wilkinson's, so terribly sorry. These were, I think, 99p or a pound. I got... Very pink, which is the roses and grapefruit, gorgeous. And I also got teas, which is red fruits and woods. I don't know how they know what woods smells like, I'm sure, but there you go. Um, then, even though I know I've got the um, Primark Beauty Wipes, I picked up a couple of my staple, all time favourite, all time favourites, which is the Nivea ones. These are also the exfoliating ones because I do love exfoliation. Then I picked up a new deodorant, sure, cool pink, favourite, always has been, always will be. Um, then I picked up an MUA lipstick which I've been after for ages. Um, I thought I had this one and then I did look in my collection, I haven't, so that's cool. Um, this is shade 3 and it's just a really nice bright sort of fuchsia pink. Do a swatch. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. So I got that. Then I picked up. Am I missing one here? Oh no, I've got one. Then I picked up a couple of NYC ones. I think they're new colours. Um, not really sure. I'm not sure about this one. This is um, creamy caramel, and I was supposed to pick up the latte one, so which is a bit lighter. But this is creamy caramel. It's sort of a brownie nude. Oh. My, box, my bag's moving. I'll just swatch that above there. It's quite nice though, but it's a little bit too brown for me. I'm not sure. Not sure about it. And I also picked up Peach Fizz, which is just gorgeous. Ow! Which is just gorgeous. Just a peachy colour. Really nice for the summer. And there it is there. Um, I've had this on all morning actually. It was really, really nice. Then I also picked up an MUA one. Um... And this one is in, get off, this one is in Irreplaceable, and it's one of the Perfect Pout ones, just a nice sort of pinky colour, swatch that above there, there you go, it's that one there, quite glossy, quite moisturising, just the twist up ones, um, pick that up, then I went to the Miss Sporty counter and saw that they had some new singles, um, single eyeshadows. I said singles, I don't know what the hell I'm talking about then. Did um, so I picked up, I saw, what I've, I've always, there's a story, I've always wanted to get the um, Wet n Wild Creme Brulee. Dougal, you're not going to find your bed, it's in the washing machine. Um, and these are the Make Up Your World Miss Sporty Single Eyeshadows, and I love the sort of pattern they've got on them. Um, this one is in Romance, and it's just a really nice sort of matte, is it matte? Yeah, it's matte matte colour, really pigmented, um, it's quite nice, I don't know if you're going to be able to see that there, it's just there, um, absolutely love that, and the one I've got on my eyes today, oh, I'm just loving so much, it's gorgeous, um, this is called Classy, and it's, it's just such a nice mid-toned bronzy brown, taupey brown if you like, um, really really nice, let me just swatch this one for you as well, that's that one absolutely gorgeous i've got it on my eyes as you can see and it's just really really nice um i'll swatch that there it's really really nice it's just 
just an all-time sort of all-round sort of thing. And if you spend over, I think if you bought two products from Miss Sporty, or is it NYC? Is this Miss Sporty or NYC? Oh no, I've got this mascara free with the two lipsticks from NYC. This is the Volumizing Mascara Showtime, which I've got on my eyes today. I don't know if you can see, it's quite nice. Nice extreme close-up. So that's what I got from Superdrug. Then I went into Boots. Now, the reason I went into Boots was because I had been seeing so many sort of, I get really big pores, uh, fine lines, and I'm just, I've got to the point where I'm sick of it. Um, and I've seen so many reviews on the La Roche-Posay products, um, the Effaclar um, Duo, I think it was. So I went into my local local Boots to find that, and I couldn't find it, but I did find the Effaclar K. Uh, which is a renovating care for oily skin, um, anti-relapse, comes in a box like this. This is, I'm going to have a separate review on this because this is bloody amazing. Um, this one is a 30ml tube, you really don't need a lot at all. Um, I cleanse my face, I put this on, I don't need to use a primer. Um, or a moisturiser, it just does everything for me. This is the Effaclar K, and this one is, let me just read it, if I can find what it says. Do, 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 do. I can't see what it says. Because it's all in French. Uh, yeah, basically this is a renovating care for oily skin. It, it gets rid of oily skin, it closes pores, um, and I've been using this for about four days, four or five days, and it's amazing. I don't know if you can see the pores. Of course you can't because they're practically disappeared. Um, it's amazing. I use this one during the day. At the moment these are on special offer. They're 25% off. Because this is normally quite expensive. This is around sort of £15 for a 30ml tube. Which is a lot of money. But um, while it was on special offer I thought I'd give it a go. Because if you don't try something you're just never going to know. And now I can see what the hype is about. It's it's amazing. Um, yeah, so I use that one. I, when I found that one, I also found... You know what I'm like. I also found the Effaclar Matte. Which basically does exactly the same thing. Um, but it leaves your skin matter than normal. This is actually in a 40ml tube. Um, and it does exactly what it's, the other one does. It closes the pores. It fills in fine lines. And... Well, it doesn't just fill them in, it actually smooths them because it's an actual, like, treatment. Um, uh, but it's an anti-shine one. So I picked that one up because I love it. And these were, I think, this one worked out about £9 something and this one was £10 something. So I picked up those ones. Then when I went into my larger boots, which is a bit further away, I found the Effaclar Duo. Effaclar Duo. Um, innovation, anti-mark efficiency. Right, this one is corrective, unplugging care, anti-imperfection, anti-marked. Corrects the appearance of imperfections, unclogs, blocked pores, fights against marks. This is the Effaclar Duo that everybody goes on about. Now, I use this one. This was this worked out about 11.39 or something in boots. I used this one. I tried this one as an under makeup sort of thing. And it's not... It doesn't make my makeup look as good as the other two. Um, but this one I'm going to use as the night treatment. I'm going to put this on at night. And the other two I'm going to use as a day treatment. Absolutely amazing. I'm going to do a separate review on them because I'm flabbergasted. Absolutely flabbergasted. Right, anyway. The next thing I got in boots, or the last thing I got in boots, was another backup of my nude Magic Eau de Tint. Um, love this. I was getting one for my daughter anyway, and it was buy one, get one half price, I think. So I picked up another one of those. Um, where am I going now? Oh, market stall. Market stall I picked up. Let me just get rid of these market makeup swatches on my hand. Um, right, I went to got, went, went to got. What sort of English is that? Um, I went to get or have a look at some more nude lipsticks because I'm just really into my nude lipsticks at the moment. Um, I got another L'Oreal Collection Privy. Um, this is Cheryl's Nude. It says there. Cheryl's nude. Um, it's really nice. Just a really nice sort of more of a beigey nude than the other two that I've got. But it's just really subtle and it's just really nice. So moisturising. Don't know why. It's quite a funky smell but I love the smell of L'Oreal lipsticks. 
no idea why. Um, so that's that one, that's Cheryl's Nude. Then I found in the market store another one of the Colour Sensational um, Nudes in the pearl sort of colour, the shimmery colour. And I got 842 Rosewood Pearl, which is just gorgeous, very similar actually. They are all very similar, but that one's this one here. Again, Maybelline lipsticks. Quite funky, but I like it. I like it. Then I got a couple of the normal nudes, um, which they do actually sell in Superdrug, Boots, whatever, um, for about, I think these are 6 99 or 7 99 each, but on the market store they were £3. So the first one I got is Tantalising Taupe. I don't know if I've actually showed you this before, because I did get a duo backup of it. Um, this one's Tantalising Taupe. And that's that one just there. Absolutely gorgeous. Been wearing that loads. And the next one I got was Honey Beige which is slightly darker sort of brown. I don't know why, because it's called honey, which is ridiculous, but it is like a darker nude, which is that one there, which is very similar actually to the NYC one that I bought. Um, but yeah, that's all. And now, yeah, quickly, I'll just do this little thing. Um, as you know, I do, um, I get stuff sent. I have had in the past something sent from me from Miners Cosmetics. Um, I went, I literally got my shopping in today. I went downstairs to take the dog out for a wee. Nice story. Um, and I saw a little package on the floor and I recognised it and it said, I opened it and I just thought this was so sweet. This was from Miners Cosmetics. Dear Nikki, Miners Cosmetics wishes you a happy Valentine's Day. Best wishes, Sarah. Um, now Sarah is the lady that I have been um, talking to at Miners Cos Cosmetics. And she was so kind and she sent me three items, I think probably from there. I don't know if it's from a range or whatever from Miners Cosmetics, but these are gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous. The first thing she sent me was a nail polish. Um, and this one is in, has this got a name? Uh, Thousand Kisses. It's supposed to shake it up. Right, this is the nail varnish. Absolutely gorgeous. I haven't done a swatch of it yet. Like I said, I was so excited because it was um, just... It's just a really nice sort of... I don't know what it'd be like with two coats, but that's one coat there. Just a really nice pink. Very shiny. Um, yeah, love that. I'll be doing a review on these anyway. Then she sent me... I do believe this is a blush stick. Yep. Um, and this is what it looks like. This one is in. It doesn't say. Oh, I hate it when they haven't got names. It's just um, 09L. It's like a corally pink, actually. It's quite nice. If I can get it open. Ah, here we go. That's what it looks like. Let me just do a quick swatch. Oh, it's very nice. Very subtle. Oh, so soft. There you go, you just see it shimmer, just, yeah. Very nice. So she sent me that one as well, which I will be reviewing. And last but not least, she sent me this gorgeous uh, Moisture Effect lipstick. Um, and this is in Kiss Me Quick. Um, and it's sort of like a pinky, corally red, I suppose. It's very nice. Oh, very nice. Very moisturising. So she sent me that. Oh, I thought it was wobbly. Um, so that's that one, which... Oh, great. Um, that's that one that she sent me as well. So she sent me those three items, which I thought was really, really nice of her. Um, and I will be doing, like, a little review on them. I love that nail polish already. It's dried already, look. It's just... Oh, it's so nice. I wonder what that looks like with two coats. Shall we just have a go? Let me just paint another coat on. Still quite sheer. But it's very Valentine pinky. Ooh. So that's that one there. Very shiny. Can you see that one? Do it this. So yeah, that's my little haul, guys. Uh, little haul. <laughs> um, I will do, will be doing a review on the Effaclar um, La Roche Posay products because they are amazing and I love them. I will also be doing a little review on the miners stuff. 
anything else that you would like to see a review of do let me know in the comments box below give me a huge thumb huge that's not english a huge thumbs up if you like this video and if you like like hauls like shopping like me um and i will um do more as as many as i can possibly um so yeah guys thanks a lot thanks to my new subscribers that have suddenly popped up on my screen um I hope you enjoy my channel and the journey that I have through YouTube. I'm really enjoying myself still at the moment. Um, and yeah, I'm hoping you're enjoying it too. So I'll see you all on my next video, guys. And love you all. And I'll see you soon. Bye.